Welcome to our channel. Today, we venture into the shadowy depths of the unknown to explore the chilling possibility of Bigfoot, not in the familiar wilds of North America, but right here in Europe. For centuries, tales of large, hairy hominids have echoed through European folklore, creatures lurking in the deepest forests, leaving behind only fleeting glimpses and whispered legends. Join us now as we journey across this continent, examining 10 spine-chilling encounters that suggest Bigfoot might not be a creature confined to fiction. Get ready for hair-raising stories, detailed descriptions, and intriguing facts and opinions about these encounters. Our journey begins in the northernmost reaches of Europe, in the heart of Lapland, a land of vast snow-covered forests and long dark winters. Here, amidst the silent frosted pines, a lone figure ventured out, seeking solace in the stillness of the Arctic wilderness. As he walked, his camera rolling, capturing the serene beauty of the landscape, a dark shape emerged from the trees, a large humanoid figure covered in thick, dark fur. It moved with an uncanny gait, bipedal and surprisingly agile for its size. The footage, grainy and shaky, sparked debate, igniting the imaginations of some and fueling the skepticism of others. Could this be a European cousin of the North American Bigfoot, a relic of a time when these ancient hominids roamed freely across the continents? We move now to the Vosges Mountains of France, a region steeped in history and cloaked in dense, ancient forests. Here, amidst the towering pines and mist-shrouded valleys, hikers have long reported encounters with something strange, something that defies easy explanation. One particular account stands out, a tale that has become intertwined with the very folklore of the Vosges. A group of experienced hikers making their way along a well-worn trail, stumbled upon a sight that stopped them in their tracks. Though shaken to their core, they managed to photograph the creature's footprints, enormous impressions in the soft earth that dwarfed any human print. Could this be the source of the Vosges legends, the real-life inspiration for the tales of forest spirits and wild men that have been passed down through generations? Our journey takes us now to the rugged beauty of the Scottish Highlands, a land of mist-shrouded locks, wind-swept moors, and ancient forests that seem to hold secrets as old as time itself. Here, amidst the haunting beauty of the Highlands, whispers of a creature known as the Fear Lieth or Grey Man have echoed for centuries. Often described as a tall, imposing figure with grey hair covering its body, the Fear Lieth is more than just a local legend. A group of campers huddled around a crackling fire shared stories of the highlands, unaware that they were being watched. Then, a figure emerged from the swirling mist, tall and imposing, its body covered in what appeared to be greyish fur. Was this a genuine encounter with the Fear Lieth, a creature that has haunted the highlands for generations? The Carpathian Growl A Shepherd's Terrifying Tale Our quest for Bigfoot now leads us deep into the heart of Eastern Europe, to the Carpathian Mountains, a region of towering peaks, dense forests and ancient mysteries. Here, amidst the rugged beauty of the Carpathians, shepherds have long told tales of strange creatures lurking in the shadows creatures that defy easy explanation. Our story takes us to a remote mountain pasture where a lone shepherd tended his flock under a brooding sky. As the sun began to set, casting long shadows across the pasture, the shepherd noticed something unusual. A large, dark shape was moving among the trees at the edge of the clearing, its movements strangely fluid and deliberate. Was this a genuine encounter with a Carpathian Bigfoot, a creature that has haunted the region for centuries? 
Shadows in the Bavarian Forest, a family's close call. Our search for Bigfoot takes us to the Bavarian Forest, a wilderness of ancient trees and hidden valleys. Amidst the fairy tale beauty, whispers of the unknown circulate among hikers and villagers. On a sunny afternoon, a family hiked a secluded trail deep within the forest. They stumbled upon a sight that sent shivers down their spines. Astonished, they found large footprints near the stream, too big for any known animal. The reddish-brown giant of the Pyrenees, a mountaineer's tail. We journey now to the majestic Pyrenees Mountains, a natural border between France and Spain, a land of soaring peaks, deep valleys, and a rich tapestry of folklore and legend. Here, amidst the rugged beauty of the Pyrenees, stories have persisted for generations of strange creatures inhabiting the high peaks, creatures that defy easy categorization. Our story begins high in the Pyrenees, where a group of experienced mountaineers were attempting a challenging ascent. As they made their way up a steep, rocky slope, they noticed something moving in the distance. A large, reddish-brown figure silhouetted against the snow-covered slopes. The figure was tall and powerfully built, its reddish-brown fur blending seamlessly with the rocky terrain. Could this be a Pyrenean Bigfoot? A creature that has managed to remain hidden for centuries in this rugged and unforgiving landscape? The Almasti of the Urals, a campsite raid and an enduring mystery. Our quest for Bigfoot takes us to the Ural Mountains, a vast range dividing Europe from Asia. Legends here speak of the Almasti, a wild, man-like being in the remote Urals. At a remote campsite, hikers enjoyed the wilderness. As the flames danced, unease settled over the camp. Suddenly, a dark figure emerged, its eyes glowing in the firelight. The hikers watched in fear as the Almasti raided their camp. The Apennine Encounter A Walk in the Italian Wilderness Our journey now takes us to the Apennine Mountains of Italy, a rugged and beautiful mountain range that forms the spine of the Italian peninsula. Here, amidst the ancient forests, rolling hills, and picturesque villages, whispers of strange creatures have circulated for centuries, creatures that defy easy explanation and hint at a hidden world just beyond our understanding. Our story begins on a crisp autumn day as a couple hiked along a secluded trail in the Apennine Mountains. Lost in conversation and enjoying the beauty of their surroundings, the couple rounded a bend in the trail and came face to face with a sight that stopped them dead in their tracks. There, standing in the middle of the path was a creature like nothing they had ever seen before. The Black Forest Encounter, a walk on the dark side. We venture into the heart of Germany, to the Black Forest, shrouded in myth and mystery. This vast expanse of dark forests and picturesque villages has long been a source of fascination and fear. Our story takes us deep into the Black Forest, where a lone hiker enjoyed a crisp autumn day. As the sun set, casting long shadows, the hiker felt a growing sense of unease. In a small clearing ahead stood a creature unlike anything he had ever seen. Time seemed to stand still as the hiker stood frozen, his breath catching in his throat. Silent Stalker of the Arden. Whispers in the Woods Our final destination on this European Bigfoot quest brings us to the Arden, a region of dense forests, rolling hills, and deep river valleys. Amidst this ancient landscape, whispers of strange creatures have echoed for centuries. 
Our story begins on a foggy morning where hunters were stalking their prey. They noticed something unusual, a creature unlike anything they had ever seen before. Then it vanished into the fog, leaving the hunters puzzled. Outro. The search continues. Our journey through European Bigfoot encounters ends, leaving us with more questions than answers. From the frozen forests of Lapland to the rugged peaks of the Pyrenees and the misty Scottish Highlands, the possibility of these elusive creatures continues to intrigue. Do they point to a creature yet unknown to science, lurking in the shadows of our world? Thanks for watching. Like, comment and subscribe for more mysterious content. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the unknown.